Hello, I'm Sandra, I am campsite warden's wife and we're very excited, we've been sent a new product to review which we're going to share with you today. So here's the box, it is a Green Note GSC50 cordless uh, stick vacuum cleaner. So this is the box, a rather smart box, it's just arrived. Um, so we've got some more information on the side of the box. It talks about it's got a 12 month warranty. It's a 200 watt uh, vacuum cleaner. You can do floor cleaning, corner cleaning, sofa cleaning and mattress cleaning. And from what I've seen so far, it might be quite handy for cleaning out my car, which does really need cleaning. So um, without further ado, uh, we're gonna open up the box and see what's inside. So let's have a look. Okay, so we've got everything out of the box now and it comes with a very nice instruction book. So it's all pretty clear, um, part in English there, uh, but honestly it does go through everything but it was pretty straightforward uh, to get started. So that's the instruction book. So this is obviously uh, says the charger. And then we've got the um, the main piece here. So it, the charger plugs in at the bottom. Excuse me, right? So it plugs in just there. And then when it's plugged in, there are three lights to indicate how well it's charged. So one bar, three bar, etc. Um, then the stop-start switch is here. And you can see it's lit up. So apparently you get about a 35 minute run time uh, when it's fully charged. So that's all pretty straightforward. And then there's a release button here. Mm -hmm. So you can also charge that bit separately if you wish. And then uh, that's where the attachments will go. Uh, but in addition, there's a little clip just here. Which will pop open when I get my hands sorted out. There we go. So that's where the uh, all the muck and everything goes inside. So you just twist anti-clockwise to pull out. And uh, this part can be separated and cleaned. You've got the HEPA filter there. And you've also got a spare HEPA filter. So these can be washed, but it says just to make sure that they're really dry uh, before you start using it again. So that just snug, snugly fits in. There are some clips just to make sure those, when you twist back in, the clips are engaged so you get good suction. And that clips back on. So that's that part. And then again, the uh, collection unit clips onto the power unit. It's all pretty straightforward so far. Obviously you wouldn't have that clipped in when you're using it. Right, so the different attachments. So this is the main floor attachment. Uh, which you can see there. Uh, so we've got, as I said, we've got the vacuum part clipped onto the power part and there's a the fitting there. So it can either clip straight in like that. Um, by the way, there are further instructions and QR codes uh, for care and maintenance and so on on the actual unit um, as well as what's in the instruction book. Or you can uh, also Get the right way up. I guess it's that way up. Um, there's also an extendable piece as well. So if, you do, if you're doing floor vacuuming, and the extendable piece also extends. So you can see there, so it can longer and shorter in sections. So that's quite handy, so it's all height adjustable. Good for the back. So that's that one, and then as well as the floor piece, just, just to point out one really nice feature with it. So it's fully adjustable with angles and everything. If you can see that, okay. And it can also click fully upright if you wish. And it just lifts to pull out again. And it also goes fully flat. Look at that, completely flat. If you need to get under tight spaces. So that's pretty handy. Just move that for a moment. So the um, 
So as you can, I'll show you that in a minute, how to, how to connect to the main floor tool, but you can also uh, connect to the smaller tools. This particular one's the crevice tool. This clicks in like that. So say if you're in a caravan or a car or something, that, that could be quite handy. And it clicks straight in. And then uh, this is an angle tool to get in all, to all sorts of corners. And I think also the settees and um, mattresses and things you can use that for. So again, just clicks in, it's all quite handy. Okay. So you can use it directly like this. So just give you a little example. So you can also clean hard surfaces as well. It's all very adjustable and manoeuvrable. So let me just show you, first of all, without the long handle, because it might be a bit hard to see, but um, so that can again click directly in if you're just doing a short bit and you can it can stand like that when you're not using it as well and we can click it out so I'm just going to show you that going and you've got some lights along the front so you can see what you're doing that could be handy as I mentioned as, as well as hair services uh, it's recommended for pet hair we're going to try that out in a little bit and it does have a dual speed function as well. So I'll just let it go in again. And if you press that one up here, and the increase the speed, decrease the speed. Okay, so we're going to give that a try on a, on a proper floor surface in, in a wee while. Let's click that out. And then if you're going to use it with the extended handle, and it just clips in think that way. Lovely. And then the main unit sits on top. So, so that's a little, yeah, anyway, I hope you can see that okay. Uh, it's quite neat really isn't it yeah so it's just really lightweight as well so if you've got any back issues and things like that it's really nice and light to handle but i think to show you any more oh i will show you one more thing before we go on so i'll just disconnect this again and just show you one more thing before we do a proper demo on the floor that's that part let me just show you this little tool so so this uh, is a little cleaning brush but it's also got uh, a little blade. So you know when all the long hairs can wrap around the um, the unit, the roller underneath is picking up fluff and all sorts of things inside there. So that just slides out. So there's a little, it's marked on, it just slides out from that end. You can pop the whole thing out. Let me get my fingers around it. <laughs> there we go. So you can pop the whole thing out. And what you can do then, is you can got a cleaning brush as well, but you can also go along if there are any uh, tangled hairs around it and cut the hairs off as well. So I don't know about you, but it's one of my least favourite jobs is getting long curled up hairs off from around the roller. Uh, so it's great to have that extra little tool in that. I just want to click that back in. Just make sure it's clicked all the way in. So there we go. How about that? Okay, so yeah, this screen now, one nice feature with it is it's completely freestanding. And so there's no worries about finding somewhere secure to put it or, or anything like that. It's, it's really sturdy and freestanding, which is really great. And you can store it wherever you like, really. Uh, I'm, so I'm just going to take off the extended bit and show you cleaning a settee. so easily right so um, so you can clean settees and even curtains and cobwebs and things by the way but we're just gonna have a go We've got joined by rash of the dog for this one so we'll see how we get on so I'm just gonna uh, give it a go uh, see how it cleans this wow look at that you can even get the dog hairs out look
the curtain. Power, of course, as well. The next section. Definitely picking up stuff. Okay, so um, so I've got the uh, crevice tool on the extension. So if you did have high ceilings, you could extend it all the way out. But we don't have really high ceilings. But anyway, just to show you, you can get right into all sorts of awkward places with this. It's nice and light. It's not too heavy to lift as well. And you can increase the speed again if you wish. And you also spot the cobweb. The cobweb there. Okay, so I'm, I'm, I'm just going to do a quick demo here, but I'm just going to explain. It may not look quite how you expect, but I'll explain why. So here we go. So when you go backwards, it's, it pauses, so it only actually picks up going forwards. It's probably a bit easier this way. So. so if you can hear it, Slowing down, it's, it's just powering up as it goes forward, so you get the maximum dust pickup. It's quite clever, I think. And you can also go on the high speed as well again. Clean very nicely. Just going to come up to another step. Variable speed, but it's focusing on when you're going forward, so you get a really good clean. Go right up to the edge. Looking pretty good. you've enjoyed that little demonstration of this Green Note GCS, sorry, GSC 50. Uh, if you do want to know more information about it, there are links below. So for what it does, it is an amazing price. And as I say, the um, battery life is about 35 minutes on that. And we're still on, um, the show is still on two. So we've done a fair bit of vacuuming there, so it's still, still on two bars there. Don't know quite how much that is in time. Uh, I'm just going to show you also how to empty the bag. So let's have a look. So just there's a little clip there to come back. Hope you can see that okay. Whoa! Look what we've picked up. I should also mention our dog Rasha is a very hairy dog and sheds a lot of fur. So it's done a remarkably good job of cleaning up the dog fur. And look at that dog fur! Woo! So much fur! So that's done a fantastic job to be fair. Um, amazing! And there's not too much less stuck on the brush. So you just twist that out again. There we come. And to be fair, that's a very good fine filter on, on the outer filter. And you've got a little bit of dirt on the HEPA filter, but that's actually not too bad. I'm impressed with that part. Very good. So, uh, so it's so easy to clean, pop it back in and away you go and if you've got heavy usage you might want to wash the HEPA filter as well but 
that's an option. So there you go, the green notes, GSC 50. Uh, have a look on the links below if you'd like to know a bit more.